Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today is July 19th, 2018. It's 8.16am and I'm just about to leave for my appointment at the allergy clinic. If you've been following me over the last few months, you probably know that I've been waiting since March to figure out what I'm allergic to. I got a pretty bad allergic reaction on my fingers in early March. But as you can see, it's a lot better now. I was diagnosed with seasonal allergies about eight years ago, but I'm interested to see if the allergic reaction on my fingers was caused by that or something else. My allergies have been pretty bad recently and I just want to get back to going to an allergy clinic because they know a lot more about allergies than just any other doctor. Also, if my eyes look red or I'm sounding a little bit different, that's because I haven't been able to take any allergy medicine for three days because they want to really see how bad your allergies are without anything. I usually take Sertrazine every morning. This is generic Zyrtec and this helps a little bit. I also take Flonase, which is a nasal spray and this stuff is really awesome. I just started taking it again recently. You used to need a prescription for these sprays, but now you can just buy them over the counter. And then lastly, I take eye drops. These have been a lifesaver for me recently because there's a lot of pollen in the air. I think that's pretty much everything that I want to say for this intro. I'm going to try to record some clips at the clinic and then I'll talk to you all about the results after. I'm pretty excited because I've been waiting for this for a long time, but I'm also kind of scared that something will go wrong again and the Aetna insurance won't be my primary. So hopefully that doesn't happen, but now I'm just going to put on my shoes and get my bag and walk to the clinic. So I made it to the clinic, but I'm about 35 minutes early. So I'm gonna go walk over to Trader Joe's and pick up some chia seeds because I'm almost out. And then I'm gonna come back here and check in. So I just left Trader Joe's. I got some chia seed and some agave nectar because I'm out of both of those. There were a lot of other things that I wanted to get, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to go home between my appointment and work. So I just got these two things and now I'm gonna go walk over to the clinic and check in. So I just talked to the allergist and he said he was gonna give me a skin test and that he could prescribe me some better cream for my fingers. And then we could also talk about allergy shots and other things. So I'm really excited. So I'm wearing a gown now. And I just got the allergy test in my back. Didn't really hurt that much. Now I just have to wait for a little while to see how I react to it. So I just got done with my appointment and I got my test results. I'm allergic to everything that has a three out of three on it. So I'm basically allergic to a bunch of tree pollens, a bunch of grass pollens, and a bunch of weed pollens. I tested positive for more samples than I did eight years ago. So I'm not really surprised by the results at all. Basically the doctor went over the results with me and then he prescribed eye drops and cream for my fingers and then I also signed the consent form for immunotherapy shop so I can start those as soon as I get my insurance company to approve the codes and as soon as they make the shots for me so I'm really excited that's exactly what I wanted and according to the doctor if I do the shots there's an 80% chance that I'll be cured of allergies and since the appointment only took about an hour I'm going to head to the pharmacy and pick up my prescriptions and then go to work. So I just got my prescriptions from CVS and now I'm just waiting for the shuttle so that I can go to labor and go to work. It's really loud out here, so I'll talk a little bit more about everything when I get to school. So I'm at SJSU now, and a dance class is happening in the place that I usually film. So I'm filming in the stairwell, but I just want to go into a little bit more detail about the appointment. Basically, I went to the clinic and talked to the doctor, and I talked to him about my previous history with allergies. And then I also showed him some pictures of the allergic reaction that I had on my fingers back in March, and I said that I wanted to find out what caused that. Then I did an allergy test, which I already showed y'all. Basically, I'm allergic to a bunch of different types of pollen. Then after I got the results, he asked me what I wanted to do about it. He gave me three different options. The first was to just avoid things that I'm allergic to, which wouldn't work for me because I don't have a car and I have to walk places. The second option he gave me was prescriptions. He said that he could prescribe me a stronger allergy pill that I could take every day that might help with my allergies. The third option he gave me was immunotherapy, also known as allergy shots. It's basically where they inject a small amount of substance that you're allergic to into your body every week for six months, and then you get injections every month or two for a few years after that. So I ended up asking for a combination of the second and third options. They sent some prescriptions for me to CVS, which I picked up. First one is some stronger eye drops because I was just using the over-the-counter ones. And the second thing was some stronger steroid cream for my fingers. He said that the stuff is really strong and that I can only take it for two weeks. I think there's six or seven classes of steroids, one being the strongest, and these are two, which means they're pretty strong and they'll probably work. And then I also said that I wanted to start immunotherapy, so I signed the consent form for that. But I should hopefully be starting those within the next few weeks or so. I just have to call Aetna and get them to approve it, and then I have to call the clinic so that they can make the shots. Because they actually make the shots specifically for you and your body 
and your allergies. And I know that immunotherapy is going to be a really long process, but I'm just really excited to get started with it so that I can move forward and not have allergies anymore. I've been taking allergy pills and sprays and things like that for about eight years now. And while those do help with my symptoms, they don't actually cure my allergies. But immunotherapy does in 80% of patients. That's why I'm choosing to do that. I just really don't want to have to rely on pills and sprays for the rest of my life. Let me know if you want me to make immunotherapy shot updates. I think I haven't seen very many people talking about it on YouTube, and I think that it can be a really great option for people. I think that's pretty much everything that I wanted to say in this video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. Also put the contact information for the clinic and the doctor that I went to in the description as well. I highly recommend them. They were so kind and professional and answered all my questions. So thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for supporting me throughout this process. I love you all so much. Stay awesome and I'll see all of you very soon with a new video. Goodbye.